We out here at Dome Cycle over here in Charleston, West Virginia. Just picked up all the parts for the Supermoto. So all that will be good to go. If you guys need Honda, Yamaha, Kawasaki, got jet skis, ATVs, dirt bikes, side-by-sides. I also sell uh, Artie Catter Trexton now that it's called. Holler at my boy Brandon. Uh, over here, he's in sales. He'll hook you up. I guarantee he'll probably beat anybody's prices. Hey guys, so we're back home now. Uh, got the 2008 WR250X, which is our going to be our project buy for this little mini series that we're going to do. Got a whole bunch of coastal parts in today, as you've seen earlier in the video. So, what I bought was all new plastic front to back for this thing. Um, if you watched the other video on the spoke covers, I revealed what color it was going to be. And there's limited cover options for this bike. There is the blue that came on the 2008, the black that came on the 2009, and the white that came on the 2010 and 2011. You can get the uh, newer WR250R plastic that I do believe works on this thing. But I wanted this bike to match my new R1 that I got that uh, is getting fixed right now and I'll reveal later on, uh, probably this winter sometime. But without further ado, let's start on about some stuff. So, like I said, we are going with white on this bike, obviously. Uh, it matches the spoke covers, got all new side plastics, got all new all plastics, like I said. So let's get the unboxing this. So here's just an overview of everything that we got. I uh, got the rear fender, uh, both side panels. We have both new number plates. We got the headlight bezel. We have new fork guards, which mine are black currently. They're gonna be white. And we also, instead of the factory front, front fender, ordered an Acerbi's uh, Supermoto front fender in white that we're gonna be putting on as well. So it will have the actual Supermoto look to it. Instead of the more trail, what I call a trail front fender. So this is probably the last time you're gonna see it in this configuration here because we're gonna be going all white. I'm not sure as far as graphics what I'm gonna do yet. Also gonna get a new uh, plate holder tail light set up. If you have any suggestions for that, please feel free to comment below. But, so like I said, this is probably gonna be the last time that you see this bike in the blue and white configuration. It's going all white as I've showed you. So I appreciate your all's got support. Uh, over 1,500 subscribers now, looking for 2,000. So if you like this video, give me a big subscribe, thumbs up, and I'll see you guys on the next video.